one of the biggest financial issues that can negatively impact a marriage is how each spouse views and handles money. Most financial issues come down to the fact that both partners have different core values about money. Today we are going to be asking men and women what they feel about hiding their finances from their spouse. One should let your spouse know how much you earn or what you make. However, this is based on the foundation of your union. Because if you're married, you have to get to understand the financial education uh, level of your spouse, such that that would determine what you can disclose to your spouse. But basically, normally you should disclose how much you earn. It helps for proper planning and budgeting for the family. Specifically, my salary, she knew everything about my income. I guess I'm excluding some other expenses, maybe some Toki outside. Sometimes I do tell her after we spend the money or we utilize, sometimes she just asks me, on the way did you get that money from? It's like it's out of her salary, but she knew almost everything about my income. So not all, but at the end, I'm still, she still needs to be aware. I know everything about money. In fact, she just believed. I didn't tell her, she believed, her money is my money. Because, you know, I would say, let two become one. So everything we do is with one. Anything she takes home is for us. Anything I take home is for us. Yes, I will tell my husband, this is the amount they pay me. Okay, I receive 50000 as my salary. I receive 70000 as my salary. Okay, this is the amount. Okay, um, let me take care of buying the foodstuffs in the kitchen. This is what I can do. Then you take care of the rest. And even in, on his own part, if it's not forthcoming, I can definitely assist. There are a lot of things that will be happening in the house that we both have to run together. You know, most times there, used to, there are some certain things that we look at is the responsibility of the guy. One of the days whereby you say it is only the guy that will take care of the responsibility. It is the guy that should pay my child's school fees. It is the guy that should pay the house rent. It is the, guy. the point is, if the guy is not forthcoming and you are not helping him, the point is, the disgrace will be, it will be on both of you. I don't need to hide my finances to my wife. My wife knows all my bank accounts. You don't understand. Most time, I used to give her my ATM. Go and withdraw money. If you say you want, you need forty thousand there, and you withdraw more than forty thousand. If there is money, you know. In terms of um, um, account management, in terms of um, opening account, and uh, I do it in partnership with my wife. There's an account I have a partner with in partnership with my wife, and then I have my separate account. She'll that I manage on my own with her consent. Even my pay slips, I give her my pay slips every year, every month. My pay slips, my account, in fact, my, my, my salary a lot is on her phone. Now, when we talk about joint account, one can always call it project account, whereby what you simply do is that you have, a, a, you have something you want to pursue, both of you just like an educational account for your children is a joint account whereby you can prepare for the future of your children in terms of education or in terms of what to get for them and a joint account or project account for other things of life should be encouraged whereby you put you pull resources into that account from your own side what are you bringing from the other person's side what are you bringing monthly it depends on you and your partner if you both of you understand each other and you're willing to like have to join the account then it's fine it's fine it depends on you and the other person but personally i don't think i can have a joint account with my partner because i don't know i like to spend a lot most times and what if he's not willing to or he doesn't buy the idea of me buying every shoe i see or buying every cloth um, every dress i like and he'll start bringing up talks and I feel like when I work for my money I should be able to spend it the way I want without being questioned about anything unless we are actually we are, unless we actually have that account for a purpose we are like saving for the kids school fees and all that then that's fine but having just a joint account between I and my partner is a no no a lot of times we have projects that we want to achieve and do together and if we don't uh, what's the word now motivate each other and keep you know pushing each other we may end up not achieving that purpose so the joint account helps us to check each other check make each other then save at the same time to be able to achieve what we intended to achieve 
I believe in joint accounts, but um, I believe apart from having a joint account with my spouse, I should also have my personal savings. I don't really believe in joint accounts because men, there are some responsibility that you know, you know, allow, you know, let your wife know. So that you know women, women say, ah, you give so-so person this money, you give so-so person this money. So that, that's why I mean I don't believe in it. 